Unarusha maneno ambaye inakera watu ambaye inasumbua watu wengine mpaka watu wanajiuliza if everybody was to behave the way you are behaving then you will never have had the opportunity to lead the country with dignity in fact juzi your excellence kenya kweli ni nchi ya demokrasia lakini kuna maneno viongozi wengine wanaongea mpaka unaangalia as a young person i get scared i saw with so much shock and dismay former prime minister raila former vice president kalonzo musyoka ati wanasema they want kenya to succeed wanataka kenya sasa turarue sijui mara mbili ikae pande gani na pande gani just because walishindwa kwa uchaguzi surely it is so shameful that even after occupying the highest of offices in the land you still can entertain such thoughts and incite young people to anarchy just because you are pursuing selfish personal ambition as leaders we should be happy and proud to know that if another gets an opportunity to serve our country we will all succeed pamoja vile inatakikana sio maongeo kama hiyo ambayo tunasikia kutoka kwa wale viongozi sisi sasa kama vijana tutafanya nini ikiwa ni wazee wanasema turarue nchi vijana wadogo watafanya nini kweli jamen sisi tunakashifu maongeo kama hayo na kuwaambia tafadhalini mwe wazee ambaye wamehitimu kimiaka na kitabia hata siasa zenu pia ziambatane na yale maneno ambaye mnayozungumza yawe ni mambo ya kujenga taifa yetu si ya kuharibu nikikaribia kumaliza your excellence mimi najua tuko hapa kwa kanisa na kama vile sisi usema kila jumapili ya kwanza ni kwamba sisi ukuja kwa kanisa kushukuru kwa sababu kama sio Mwenyezi Mungu hatungekuwa pahali tuko ya pili mimi nataka niombe uongozi wa kanisa uwaombe wewe na rais wetu William Ruto because i don't think there have been leaders ambaye wamewahi kupewa inchi in a tattered state and in a very difficult time kama nyinyi wawili na ile changamoto mnapitia sahi as we speak today i can't recall a president who for every 100 shilling ambaye na ukoto kwa ushuru more than 75% inaenda kwa kulipa deni unabakia na 25% ulipe walimu upepe pesa kwa counties ufanye maendeleo na ndio hiyo ukijaribu kuweka ushuru kidogo unasikia vile kelele inatoka kwa mtu yote wa kawaida so i know you need a lot of prayers and grace but we are praying for you and we know that the promises that we made to the people kwamba tutainua wale ambao wako chini hadi maisha yao iwe afadhali Mwenyezi Mungu atawapatia mawazo mazuri ili maneno yao hayo yaweze kutumia. Me I know it is possible. I have a strong belief deep down that even despite the difficulties and the challenges that you are going through as a country that between you and the president you have the necessary experience, you have God has given you the wisdom and the strength and you will take Kenya to the next level. Hiyo I have no doubt about it and I urge wananchi that we keep our faith in our leaders unajua ukisikiza vizuri hii kelele ambaye iko hapa nje mara mingi wengi wa wale wanaongea na kusema maneno mengi are those who in the first place they never believed in us kwa hivyo sasa wanaona ni kama wamepata opportunity ya kuambia watu oh si tuliwaambia mnaona sasa vile inaiko shuali baada ya miezi nane hata mtoto anayezazaliwa leo na atembee kesho si kuna process ya vile unaenda na unajua baada ya viongozi wetu kuchaguliwa kumekuwa na challenges kulikuwa na kiangazi ambaye jaonekana karibu miaka 40 mimi nasikia wanatuambia ati warakisheni bei ya chakula ishuke chini ni kweli tunangangana mumepeana mbolea lakini mbolea imewekwa na mahindi na mea hasa unless wawapatie basikiti ya kuvuruta mahindi ikuje juu hivi mara moja hakuna njia nyingine ya kufanya ni hiyo ambaye nyinyi mumefanya siku ya leo kwa hivyo nyinyi keep your eyes on the prize liberating our people economically that is what we promise kwamba kila mtu aweze kuwa na pesa katika mfuko yake and i know that that one can be achieved sitaki kusema mengi zaidi ya hapo uh, your excellency because i know that uh, we have been here for so long in fact tutaomba msamaha kidogo kwa kanisa because much as it is a celebration we have actually as a political class tumeongea longer than the church uh, which is sometimes not very good Next time tutajipanga vizuri ili tupunguze maneno